These are the likely faces of American trade policy under incoming U.S. President Donald Trump. They represent a strong message to Beijing. The U.S. plans to toughen its trade policy with China. According to a Trump spokesperson, the team will be led by billionaire investor Wilbur Ross. Ross, if confirmed as Commerce Secretary, will set White House trade policy, along with business professor Peter Navarro. In a white paper they wrote for the presidential campaign, they blamed China's 2001 entry to the World Trade Organization for accelerating the offshoring of America's factories, called China the biggest trade cheater in the world, and pledged to confront China's continued high tariffs on American products. In response to the Navarro announcement, Beijing pushed back. We hope the U.S. side can work with China to maintain a healthy and stable development of China-U.S. relations, including trade relations. Former Reagan trade official Robert Lighthizer is Trump's choice for U.S. trade representative. That's the top negotiator for U.S. companies. Lighthizer has called for going outside the WTO to resolve trade disputes and advocates taking a much more aggressive approach in dealing with China. Beijing is watching closely. China and the U.S. should work together to ensure the sound and steady development of bilateral economic ties, as this serves the common interests of the two countries and peoples. Donald Trump has promised to renegotiate trade agreements to help keep American manufacturing jobs at home. He's also created the National Trade Council. It'll be housed at the White House and run by China critic Peter Navarro. Jessica Stone, CGTN, Washington.